John Hancock Tower rising above the bustling city of Boston and its tree-lined streets. 2K Sports presents the NBA Monday Night Basketball. It's coming right up with Hall of Famer Doris Burke and Greg Anthony. This is Kevin Harlan. On the sidelines, we have David Aldridge reporting. And the upcoming schedule for the Mavericks. On Wednesday, I'll be facing Stephen Adams and the Oklahoma City Thunder. Then on Thursday, they'll tip off a road trip in Brooklyn where they'll take on the Nets. And Kevin, I think you have to look at this as an opportunity to take a step forward. Sometimes tough road trips can bring the best out of a team and bring you closer together. And with tip-off coming up, we've got just enough time to hear from our good friend David Aldridge on the sideline. D.A., take it away. Kevin, thank you. David, he is the total package. And every year, Doris, more terrific players coming into the NBA. How good a position do you think the league is in right now as far as talent is concerned? I mean a great position, to be honest with you, Kevin. The players, arguably, to me, are more skilled and more athletic than ever. The global reach of the game means that competition for an NBA spot on a roster is fiercer than ever. Now, we'll look at Dallas's starting lineup. They've got Nowitzki. Jalen Brunson out there with Richardson. Then there's Doncic, and it's Brzingis in at the five down low. And for Boston, Bird is out there with Russell. That's Rajon Rondo. Then it's Ennis Cantor, and it's Rozier in at the shooting guard. Now here's Brunson. Over in the corner, Doncic. Off target from three-point range. And so it's Russell with it. He'll bring it up for the Boston Celtics. Here's Rozier. Pass to Canner. To the middle. Russell, no good. Novitsky kicks to Richardson. Dallas moving it around. That's tipped. Bird against Doncic. And Bird, here we go. Good work defensively by Richardson. For the Celtics, they come into this one following a loss to the Knicks in New York. And defensively in that one, they needed to come up with big stops sure. to quiet that crowd. And that's obviously easier said than done. I'll tell you this. It looked like they wanted to get out of town as quickly as possible. The problem is their defense went with them. Rondo passes to Russell. Tipped away. Pantage with the steal. Over Rondo. Not wasting any time and taking the shot and knocking it down. Boy, I forgot somebody had even scored. What a basketball mind when you think about Luka Doncic. This guy in the break is exploiting defenses. Right shot by Rondo. Good about that. I don't want to burn my boy Rondo. An aggressive move to the rack and, and where's the help defensively to me that's a complete lack of communication on that side of the ball these guys need to be talking to each other oh go get it big fella poor Zingas with the skyscraper the Celtics have gone one of three for the field to start this one so far Rondo against Brunson balls knocked loose Now here's Rondo. Defense is right there. The shot's good from Canterbury. Elite offensive rebounder from the moment he stepped between the lines. And his canter, that is a strength of his game. Hits it from three-point range. Doncic. Doncic has got five now. And I like to see this. They're calling his number early, and he's delivering. They know that if this guy goes off, their chances of winning rise exponentially. Rozier with the ball. Out guarded by Porzingis. He gets that one. You know, I really like this. Instead of putting his head down, Terry Rozier keeping his eyes up and finding his open teammate. And every year, Terry Rozier seems to get better. Specifically, Greg, becoming a more efficient and lethal scorer. I mean, he's improving his percentages over the years, especially sure. no, his three-point shooting. He three. came into the league, was not a threat from deep. Now, you have got to honor that outside shot. And here's Rondo. Dirk Nowitzki getting his three to go. Yeah. Nowitzki oh, against right The kick out to Rozier. 
sinks the triple. And an eye for an eye. Both teams working to stretch the floor. Well, that three-point shot just gives you so much room to operate on the offensive end. Rondo against Brunson. Oh, Russell in position. Nowitzki with the steal. One-on-one -on -one fast break. Here's Persingas in the dunk by Persingas. Well, seven foot three doesn't need much of a vertical. Easy finish for KP. Celtics trail by five. And there's the foul. It's on Jalen Brunson. Jalen. That's his first foul. JaVale McGee's checked in for Boston. First team foul. Checking in for the Mavericks. We have got to see that sensational mobile one block again. And right out of the gate, trying to set the tone defensively, you've got to love that energy. Here's Rondo. Nine point game, his last outing. To the wing right side. Here's Russell. Inside. And it's blocked. Go the Mavericks in a fast break. Here's Brunson. And it's good assisting on the <laughs> I don't know why they did it because I didn't get it. I didn't already in a flow. Some stellar shooting to jump out to this league. I've been pissed that, that got blocked. Oh, man. Austin with the ball. Seven point differential. And this matchup with Dallas, it's their first meeting of the season. That should be an interesting game as these teams don't see a lot of each other. Two teams from different conferences. Right, they'll meet two times this year East versus West. Let's see which team can enforce their style of play. Here's what Boston's going with right now. Gordon Hayward's checked in for Russell. Smart comes in for Oju. And it's Pritchard in for Rajon Rondo. It's blocked, and he recovers it. Dallas leading by seven. Richardson kicks to Brunson. Out left to the wing. Pass to Richardson. Shot clock at six. Throws up on the high post. No good on the shot, a bit long that time. And that's where you want to make the next pass. This guy is a good scorer, but the defense was right on him. Hayward passes to Smart. Buries it from three-point range. Well, Marcus Smart has come so far as a three-point shooter. This guy very capable from distance. Richardson outside. Count it. Yeah, he's shown terrific control of the pace and the rhythm of this offense. And I think they count on him for that. He is a tone setter, extremely unselfish. Here's Pritchard following the score by Josh Richardson. Here's Bird, and it's Boston with another. Well, that's the IQ of Gordon Hayward on display. He understands what the defense is trying to take away and finds the open man. Here's Finley. 17 points in his last outing. Brunson finds Nowitzki. Passes to Finley. Trying to get open is Nowitzki. And Finley gets it to go. What a terrific play by just a tremendous all-around player. This guy makes it look easy. Celtics trail by six. Poke loose. The pass to Bird. And he lobs it up toward the rim. Nowitzki with the steal. Pass to Finley. To the inside. Back to Brunson. Dallas moving it around. Smart against Richardson. Over Bird. That's blocked by Bird. Hayward outside. Into the lane. Here's McGee. And terrific work on the offensive line, and he picks up two. Second chance points always oh, hurt. Just oh. not enough effort to block out. No doubt those extra possessions can really add up oh, against you when you do not take care of the defensive glass. And Dallas calls their first time out of the game. They come into this one following a loss to the Thunder. Yeah, that was a rough 
out and reach. They did a few good things, but substitution on the court. Here's Brunson. 17 point lead, their biggest. Here's LaFrance. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. That one good for two. Well, you can see the will that Josh Richardson plays with. Contact, not a problem for this guy. Boston's got nothing but zeros from long range in the second quarter. 0 of 4. So with Nowitzki sitting on the bench, here's a 5 for Jason Kidd right here. Jalen Brunson out there with Richardson. Then there's Marjanovic. And it's LaFrance in at the four-man position. You know we talk about it all the time, guys. Those second-chance buckets, always the result of that extra effort. And Vinny Smith gets it to go. This from Jalen Brunson. Celtics trail by 19. Pass to Shamit. And so it looks like the Celtics will retain possession here. Dirk Nowitzki, he's checked in for Dallas. Dirk Nowitzki. Here's Pritchard. Offensive rebound. Good work defensively by Richardson. Mavericks leading by 19. Finney Smith passes to Brunson. And he gets off the fast break with a monster slam. Love seeing a point guard who can explode to the rim like that. Oh, great attitude and even a better finish. Boy, it's incredible how much explosive scoring ability can come from the lead guard position. That is a big-time play. Passes it to Bird. From deep three-point range, and they get it back. Wow, just getting all the luck right now, it seems. Good bounce. Lock at six. Another shot. Doesn't go that time. Now Dallas takes it the other way. No doubt it's been a bit of a struggle for him here in this quarter in no, terms of scoring. And we've got an assistant. update here, so let's check Jay in with David Aldridge so along from the sideline. Thank you, Kevin. Kristoff Przingis is returning to form after his knee surgery. He says making sure it's strong and stable is nonstop work, but I'm feeling better, and I have confidence that I can go out there and play freely. His offense has been great the defensive end that he's still getting right. Guys? Well, we know he can be a presence, D.A., and I think eventually he's going to be what he wants to be. Thank you. Oh, great ball movement there. The Celtics shooting at 36% on the night. They've got to step it up offensively. And the former 40th pick Doris back in 2015 out of Tennessee. But you know, Josh Richardson has been a rotation player from the very start. He has, and a starter from his second season forward. Let's remember, in high school, he was a two-star recruit. But somehow, with his work, he becomes a quality NBA player that teams love having on their roster. And Greg at 6'5 and 200 pounds. Not the most imposing frame for Josh Richardson, but he is a quality defender. Well, a lot of it is between the ears. I mean, the plus wingspan helps, but it's that competitive will that enables him to hold his own. So the Celtics call timeout their first. And we've heard some talk, Greg, about the possibility of NBA expansion. Uh, what do you think about that? Kevin, I think it would be great for the league. I mean, I played in Seattle this season. I know they would love to have a team back in the great Northwest. Dallas making a switch here. Doncic is checked in. Pritchard passes to Russell. Now Bird to end the run. It's hauled in by Richardson. I'll tell you, it's been a struggle for him in this period, and they're struggling as a result. Here's Pritchard, runs in covering. Bird outside. And the pass to McGee. It's rebounded by Doncic. 
Doncic has got four rebounds in this game. Brunson kicks to Doncic. Pass to Richardson. Over Russell. No good off the back of the rim. Celtic shooting the measly 26% in the second quarter. Burr. Man. Who's back up? And that one's good. Russell. <laughs> the Russell's got four points <laughs> now got in the quarter. Oh, and oh. this is the problem. The, the length, the timing. Russell, one of the very best at corralling misses and turning them into points. Oh. He muscles it in through the contact, and they call the foul. And he's on his way to the free throw line. First of the yeah. foul. Special when you're drafted third and people still Doncic. can't believe you Shooting slipped one. that far. That's how good Doncic has been in his young career. Looking at who's out there now for the Celtics. Cantor is checked in for JaVale McGee. Terry Rozier comes in for Landry Shamit. Rajon Rondo is subbed in for Pritchard. Doncic, no good on the free throw. Yeah, nice job of drawing the contact and creating opportunities at the line. Looking to get it going. Oh, and the jam by Bird. You know, Bird never had that elite burst out of his stance, but what he does have is incredible instincts, just reads the defense and anticipates the drive. Nowitzki outside. Bangs home the trifecta. Nowitzki. Nowitzki's got 10. And with the lead, I like the strategy here. Continue to get the ball to guys who can do something with it. One thing we've learned in the NBA, the game is never over. So you've got to continue to score, continue to build your lead. Jaylen, you got to love his hustle. The, the defense, no time to react. Richardson. The finishing transition, nice and easy. A dominating first half of basketball. And so far, <laughs> Just like the last game, close. 31. The Mavericks on top as they end the second quarter on a 20 to 6 run and don't go away after the break we'll see you right back here for the start of the third quarter and now the 2k sports halftime show after one half of play it's been a one-sided affair hey everybody welcome back this is ernie johnson alongside shaquille o'neal and kenny the jet smith dallas has the edge here at halftime they are completely in control of the game, leading by a massive amount. Kenny, what's your viewpoint? They were in such a groove that entire first half, especially on the offensive end. Good play calling, good execution, and by and large, they take good, not good, great shots. And Shaq, what are your thoughts on Boston? And they were gutting a little too much from them. They can't afford to become a on that shot. They're consistently. I'd like to see them mix it up in the second half. Thanks for joining us, folks. We're now just a few minutes away from the start of the third quarter. Well, we've got a second half of basketball for you. We think it's going to be pretty good. A big comeback, though, is needed for this game to be competitive, and it probably has to happen quickly. You know, Luka Doncic has been exceptional here, guys. You just love the patience in that first half. Waited until he got the look he wanted. You know, as a coach, you can preach good shot selection, but it's up to the players to execute, and this guy has done just that. And there wasn't too much drama in the first half, but maybe things will tighten up. Watch Larry Bird bring the ball up. Here in the second. Thirty-five for real. Oh, wow. That's what I get for simulating. <laughs> wow. Wow. We need a uh we need to see the like the full breakdown. There 
they turned it on. Wow. They put a 49 in the third? How is that possible? <laughs> How is it possible they put a 49 in one quarter, B? Come on, man. So they just start busting threes. Like, how was even that mean possessions? I'm super hungry, man. <laughs> 